In this video, we're going to go over a few things that we see some of our clients struggle with as they're refining their horsemanship. And that is often what prompts these videos, something that comes up with our clients and we think, wow, you know, that'd make a great video. And I wonder how many people out there are challenged by this. How can we help folks like you as we challenge ourselves in trying to get these things better with our horses? So today, Madison's going to help me on this little exercise. You might think of this as breaking your your job down into pieces. Break it down into little bits and pieces. We're going to be working on getting our horse to move sideways, as in a leg yield, or in this case, maybe a side pass. Perhaps one day, you'll be wanting to open a gate, and you'd like your horse to nicely move over to the gate, both ends, both the hind and the front, moving towards the gate. Well, to prepare a horse for this, we're going to think about do we really have that hind freed up, separate from the front? Do we have the front freed up, separate from the hind? As we go back to one of our very first things we do with our horse, and that is a circle, and that circle, in our groundwork, much as in riding, we're asking our horse to be nice on two tracks here, moving around, and then we focus on the hindquarters untracking, in this case, to the right. And then we break that down and we move to the front end. And we ask the front end to shift back and move to the left, helping our horse be comfortable moving her feet here. The other direction, the hind to the left, shift back, and the front to the right. Now, obviously that would be a little hard to do to open a gate when you're turning in circles. So what we want to do is get to where we can have the hind quarters moving one direction and then the front moving the same direction. So... Breaking that down, we're going to ask the hind to move to the right. And now, without going forward, I'm going to ask the front to move to the right. And you see, I can block her here. I don't want to wait too long to block. This is a challenge a lot of folks have. Once they ask the horse to move, the horse tends to blow forward, and they're late blocking that forward. So you might ask your horse for a lateral to the outside, and you get a trot forward from that energy that you offered. So again, I'm going to ask the hind to the right, and I'm going to block the front and say, no, I want you just going sideways here. The hind, and now the front. All right? I'll come in and do a little more. This time I'll be off asking my horse to move to the left. I come in here, bring her around here. The more I can get her to move her feet, the better I like it. I don't want to have to be moving around to position my horse. I'd like her to position herself for me. So here, we're going to break it down. The hind to the left. And now, the front to the left. The hind to the left. And the front to the left. Break it down. So that you can get to where you can get both ends of your horse reaching equally at the same time. A little fix there, not forward. There's the hind and the front. A little more life here. I'll come in, ask a little more life. Get her moving over more like that. So both ends are reaching equally. If you can't get this individually, hind separate from the front and front separate from the hind, you're gonna have a challenge with this. So break it down. Don't be afraid to go back to the very beginning to ask for some of these moves like a side pass or a leg yield in preparation of opening a gate or moving a cow. Hope this helps you out. 